Driving Skills for Life was started in 2003 in partnership with the Governor's Highway Safety Association to really address the issue of teen safe driving. The sad reality is that the number one cause of death of teenagers is vehicle crashes. And as an auto maker, we feel it's very important to take care of our customers. Yeah, that's what we're after. And it's going to be a big slide. Nice save. I learned a lot today about the different distractions, especially that affect teens when they're driving. Uh, teens, whether they know it or not, are always distracted while they're driving with text and music. Uh, and it really does affect the way you drive and uh, it could hurt not just yourself but other people. The number one cause of most crashes with teens deals with inexperience. So Driving Skills for Life was formulated focusing on four major areas of inexperience. Look at speeding, spacing, vehicle handling, and distractions. <laughs> oh, that was. Oh, uh, uh, there's another. There's another. <laughs> Let me go fix the course. Today we are bringing our program. It's part of a new effort we're doing, which is a 30 city, 15 state tour. We're bringing it actually to high schools. So we actually, for the first time ever, are bringing the program directly to the students. Uh, what, what you're seeing out here is we have three basic exercises. One is a vehicle handling course where the vehicle is intentionally loose so the back end will slide out. We're teaching them how to control that through proper steering and acceleration. The second one is a distracted driving course, and distracted driving has become huge with texting and things like that. And so we have an instructor in there that's actually giving them different obstacles to overcome. And what they're finding is it's very hard to drive while they're distracted. The third exercise is using fatal vision goggles, which simulate being under the influence of whether it's alcohol or drugs. And certainly, even though young people aren't supposed to do that, we know that in reality a lot of them do, and we want to make sure we teach them that you really can't drive properly when you're under the influence. So right there, no stop walking till I tell you. But when you do walk, walk, heel the toe. Don't walk till I tell you, wait that thing. Heel the toe, keep coming. Heel the toe, keep going. Keep the going. I learned today that it's, it's not right to text. Uh, I know I do it while I drive, uh, and it does affect my driving, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop. Uh, and the drunk driving and the skidding on the ice, all was really helpful simulations, and uh, it's really going to affect help my driving in the future.